Well, hello everybody and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. Home Craftology reached out to me and asked if I wanted to review a new set of four diamond paintings. So let's take a look and see what we have. And I think Home Craftology and Saner Direct are pretty much the same company, it seems. Um, maybe they're just under one big corporate name. I'm not sure, but it seems like they kind of are the same. Let's see what we have. Okay, keep that because I want to put all of these back in there. Oh, look at these oranges and yellows already. Okay, let's see. Ah, I found it right away this time. Just getting it open. I always say these are Lisa proof. And these are all 30 by 40, which is, I think, kind of the standard size for these sets of four that you can get on Amazon. I will link this uh, kit, this set, I should say, down below in the description. So we have Home Craftology 30 by 40. Each diamond painting, if you are new to diamond painting, has their own number that will correspond to the drills and it'll state this number on each drill package so you can match them up. I always keep my drills with my diamond paintings but I know there are those who keep their canvases in one area, drills in another so that's how you match them up. All right, let's look at this first one. Ooh, look at those. Oh, yellows. Ooh, look at this beautiful sunset. Oh my gosh. And, oh, there it is. I was going to say there's no toolkit. <laughs> Standard toolkit like we usually get in these sets of four. Okay. Oh, that is beautiful. We got some birds up in the sky. And I know I unboxed another set that were all landscape. These seem to be portrait and these are round drills. 34 colors in here. Oh, gorgeous. Let's take a look at the drill field. Zoom you in. Oh, very, very clear. Ooh, very sticky. Yeah, look at those gorgeous colors. Reminds me of fall colors. <laughs> and because it's poured glue, very rarely are there problems with the glue. Sometimes you'll get like a ripple or two, but typically even if you have that, it never ever um, affects really the placement of the drills. But yeah, this, this looks perfect. Okay, so yeah. And again, I always love it when they put the keys in the upper and lower corners. And when they make them larger, it's so much easier to read. <laughs> Especially when there's this many colors, a lot of times you get those real small keys. Kind of hard to read. Okay, let's look at the pretty colors. Okay, um, <laughs> um, um, there we go. Shoo. Oh, look at that peach. Pretty, pretty. All right. Keep that big to pack them back in. Oh, we got some yellows. 
and like all of Sander Direct and Homecraftology, they come in these packets with the silver, which I like because you can see the these don't have DMC codes, but you have the number and the code of the particular canvas, and you can always read them really nice with the silver bars on these packs. Okay, let's get this all out. See where we start with number one. Must be the other end. Oh, here's another separate pack. Kind of a grayish color. I guess we don't have to start with number one, do we? Look at those oranges. And I'll zoom back in. Oh, look at you. Love that orange. Look at these three oranges together. Isn't that beautiful? A lot of this color. And this one. Oh my gosh, this one's packed tight. Beautiful color. Boy, all five of those colors together. That sunset is going to be stunning. Some brown for the pier. Pretty blues for the water. Some more colors for the sunset. And probably, I'm imagining, there must be some 310s or something really dark for the birds. Maybe, maybe like this... Maybe a dark brown or something. Let's get up here on camera more. Some deep mauves. There's that color I seen. Love that color. Deep red. And there's that pretty light mint green I love. And there's more. Another whole line. Must be more. Well, this must all be in like the beach after the water. Must be part of the pier or the sand, maybe. Gray, darker gray, pretty lavender, some more gray. Yeah, we do have quite a bit of three tens. Must be the birdies and some of the pier down here. Pretty yellow. There's that pretty peach. And we ended with a gorgeous color. <laughs> we've uh, either been starting lately with the pretty purples or we've been ending with purples. <laughs> okay, so that is the first one with the beautiful sunset and the pier. I think these are all piers, I do believe. So that is the first one. Oh, these go with that one too. Tuck them underneath so we can look all at all four at the end. Let's look at the next one. Ha, I found it right away. They didn't hide that one good enough on me. Well enough? Good enough? They just don't want me to get it out. That's all. Come out. I hate that. It always sticks to it then. Has to be so difficult. And yeah, I'll repack these all off camera so I don't have to waste your time. Oh, some more gorgeous colors. This one definitely looks more like a fall atmosphere. Pretty boat. Beautiful. So yeah, here's our dock, our pier. Okay. Standard toolkit. We're getting used to those now, right? Okay. <laughs> All right. Wow. Found this right away, too. I'm getting better. 
crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. Sorry for you guys who don't like that sound. You'll have to mute this at certain times. So let's first look at the canvas, I guess. Uh, 35 colors in here. Again, I am assuming this will be really nice and clear. Oh, definitely. And even in here, let's pull this down a little. I guess this would be just one area um, because they're all real dark colors that you'll have to look a little bit closer at. With a light pad, I don't think you're going to have a problem, but yeah. And of course, it has to be in white of some sort. This maybe could have been a little bit lighter, but I think it distinguishes it from the others a little bit better. So I don't think there's going to be a real big problem with that. And even like in these yellows, the 4 and the L, you can distinguish those very easily, even though the colors are real similar. And the canvas, oh yeah, nice and clear. Not... Not a ripple in it. I didn't mean clear. I meant um, the poured glue is good. Let's say that. Okay, now let's look at the drills. Looks to be some really pretty colors in here again. Now we'll zoom back in. Whoa, that was fast. Don't mean to get you seasick. Look at that orange. Some grays, kind of greenish grays. Oh, that is a pretty color. Just a little bit of it. Where is that in here? Hmm. Oh, it must be up in here. That's neat. Part of the sunset. Lots of these browns. Look at all these together. Isn't that pretty? There's that gorgeous peach. Lots of three tens. Beautiful yellow. Some more brown. Oh, another pretty color. Must be up again in that sunset. And there's more. Oh, some more gorgeous orange yellows. Again, these colors would be so gorgeous together. Definitely look like fall colors. <laughs> but look at these blues. Must be in the boat. Very pretty. Oh, and there's more. More blue. And some more browns. That's a pretty color. Real dark mauve. Must be, uh, we had three tens already, so I think that's a real deep brown. And then white with a brown hitchhiker. <laughs> Always have to have them hitchhikers in here, right? Yes. Oh, gorgeous. Some more gorgeous colors. Okay. So, what? We put that one up here. Okay, well, let me zoom back out so you just don't get a close-up of my arm here. <laughs> Wouldn't want that. Look at we start right off with some birdies. Or bats. I think they're supposed to be birdies. I don't think some people would like bats in their picture. Well, unless it's a Halloween picture. Okay. 
Yeah, there are tons of colors in these pictures. So uh, with them only being 30 by 40s, um, I think the amount of detail in them is going to be great. Oh my gosh. Look at this sunset. Oh, we have cattails. Oh, pretty. Toolkit. Imagine that. <laughs> 36 colors in here again. And yeah, it looks like all of these are going to be portrait. Can't you see all four of these on a wall together? Oh, so yeah, we have this beautiful sunset with the birds in the sky, cattails. Oh, love it, love it. Again, let's take a look at the drill field. And definitely sticky as usual. Oh, drill field is perfect. Let's take a look. I always like to see where it's dark though. Typically, if there's going to be a problem at all, it's when you get into some of the darker colors. But no, there's no problem in here either. Very, very legible. There won't be a problem. At all. Oh gosh, that's gorgeous. So, oh, look at these purples. <laughs> Can't wait to see all these oranges and yellows. So, let's take a look at the colors. Lisa's going to have a fun time trying to get all these drills back in all these packs. Because, <laughs> of course, you can't pack them as well as they do. So, put these over here. Oh, pretty, pretty. Purdy, purdy. Starting off with the gorgeous colors. Pinks and, well, kind of a real pinky purple. More on the pink side. And then a couple of purples. So that's up in the sky by the clouds. There's my pretty peach. Not too many three tens. Ah, I thought there would be quite a few three tens in here. Really super deep, deep forest green. That's pretty. Some more gorgeous purple. Real tannish kind of greens. Some more greens for the grasses. And, okay, I'm sure this is the last color. Yeah, always ends up with the white color. There's my favorite DMC color. <laughs> it's that pretty mint green. Oh, look at that beautiful orange. Isn't that gorgeous? Some browns. Oh, pretty blue. Real light tan. Oh, some more pretty blues. Oh, look at these yellows. Aren't they gorgeous? Love that pale yellow. Because, you know, I love my pastels. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at these. One, two, three, four. These six colors together. Let's start right here. And we just keep getting a little bit darker till we get to the darkest orange red. Isn't that pretty? Oh. Wow, that is gorgeous. Wouldn't that make a beautiful color blend with uh, pencils? <laughs> and we have a tan and finally a green. Wow. Wow, wow. These diamond paintings are just, I mean, the colors in them. Zoom back out here. All right. Put that one right there.
And last, but certainly not least, is this one. Let go. Let go. You know it's going to be impossible to get them back in these, right? <laughs> I've tried. <laughs> Once in a while I succeed, but yeah, we'll, we'll uh, attempt it. <laughs> okay, let's see what this last one is. Mm, kind of stuck to itself over here. Okay, the plastic is up on here, so the canvas, the sticky canvas was showing. Goes to show you it's pretty sticky. <laughs> there we go. Oh my gosh. Look at the colors. Look at the beautiful flowers. So are these like just sunsets with like boats and piers or are they supposed to be like seasons also because this looks like spring mm, that one might be fall i'm not sure if it goes with the seasons or not it must just be like the the water and sunset yeah, so I'm I'm not sure. Like this, like I said, this one looks real springish, doesn't it? Can't wait to see the pink colors in the drills. All right. So again, these are all 30 by 40s. There's 33 colors in here, and I think there's just a few less colors in here because of all of the sky. I mean, there's what, one, two, three, there's still three different colors up here, but there's more block coloring up here rather than uh, a lot of the confetti, you know. Let's zoom you in a tad. Let's look at the drill field. Oh, perfect. Let's see what the darker colors are like. Oh, yeah. Very easy to distinguish. Even down here where it's the darkest, you have the real dark green and then the black. Yeah, very, very legible. Should not be a problem at, whoops, went the wrong way. Don't want to go that close. And yeah, again, very sticky. Don't even know why we bother testing that. But like I said, I have had one or two in the past where uh, it wasn't that sticky. So yeah, this one seems to really have a problem with the <laughs> with the with the covering. It uh, kind of got bent a little bit when it was packaged, but it's okay now. Okay, so let's look at the drills. Again, standard took it. Okay. Pretty pretty. Oh, look at these. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, the pretty. It's gonna be really pretty greens and pinks in here too. I love sunsets. There are so many pretty colors in sunsets, right? Okay, let's unfold this, and we shall start at the beginning. Zoom you back in. Real deep olive green. Oh gosh, look at these pinks. Oh, you know, in succession from the lightest, and they just go a little bit darker. Wow, that is pretty. You know, diamond painting, if you do adult coloring also, 
when you see some of these colors together, it really gives you good ideas for blending colors together on your pictures, too. Super deep green. That package is packed full. <laughs> A lot of them. Oh, look at these colors. Again, beautiful colors that, you know, all, of course, go together. I almost dropped it. The next, the next train, as Anne likes to call it. I'm going to be stealing that from you, Anne. Let's look at the train. There's a pretty uh, pastel orange, peach, and the next batch. Oh, lots of greens in here. No, not these first two. <laughs> here they come. Look at that green. Tons of that one. Really pale gray. A few more greens yet. I love these spring greens colors. That is a deep, deep purple. Gorgeous. I hope the light isn't shining too bad on here and you can see them. It's one thing about this shiny cellophane. Oh my gosh, look at these teals. Oh, they are gorgeous. All right, wow. Oh, and then, yeah, that was the other. Okay. So, there you have it. We have, zoom back out, we have this one, which does resemble spring. Let's see if, if they are kind of seasonish. And we have this one. So, this can't really be... No, they can't really be seasons. Like I said, I think they're just water or sunset scenes. Or docks, because we always have a dock or a pier in them. Because, yeah, here again. And they're, they all have that same color or colors in them. Sure, I say that and then I don't see one. Oh, it must be in here, though. Okay, so then we have this one with that pretty boat in. And then the very first one. Boy, these have some pretty colors in, don't they? If you like yellows and oranges and reds, boy. This is the set for you. Gorgeous. All right. Well, yeah, I'm going to have some fun packing this all back up. But again, I'm not going to do that with you and bore you to tears. <laughs> so again, I will link this set down below in the description. It is on Amazon if you want to go check it out yourself. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this un not boxing, this unbagging. <laughs> and if you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. And as always, happy coloring. Bye, guys. No, happy diamond painting. <laughs> Bye.